Okay, so I love the diversity of this of this series, and also you know with it especially being uh, female driven and portraying the traumas that young females face as well. Is this what drew you to uh, uh, to jump on board? Yeah, one hundred percent. The diversity for sure. I mean, in, in interest, background, um, upbringing, all of it, and telling all of those different stories. You know, you see, you know, there's a lot of shows that tell a lot of similar stories all the time that follow, you know, one mainstream person that a lot of people can relate to. So I hope that, you know, all eight of our characters can, everybody can um, take a piece from. Yeah, same, like, uh, with, with all the diversity, you know, you never really realize it's like, uh, that there are different struggles within them. So like for Sarah to like write these stories and have them all combined, it really brings out a beautiful side of like society where like you might not always look at immediately and might not always recognize because of what people are going through and they try to hide it, you know? And I feel like it was beautifully told. Yeah, and even though, you know, all these females are completely different with their completely different issues, um, they have their, their obviously their, their squabbles, but they still come together in the end. It was that what it was like for you guys on set as well. Absolutely. I mean, yeah, we uh, we each had our moments. It, it was it was high conditions, long days, and you know, typical mm-hmm. material. Um, but in the end, absolutely, we all had each other um, to support um, and be there for, which that yeah, was awesome. Yeah, like, especially at the end when we finally had that weight lifted off, like, we're finally done, and then we're finally able to look back and realize how proud of each other we all were, and so now we're just hanging on until December. Yeah. (laughs) Well, you you obviously, both of your characters, like Tony and Martha as well, you you both had to go out and venture into the wild at some point and uh, go and get your hands dirty, she would say. I'm not saying anything. Mm -hmm. Um, Did you pick up any survival skills yourselves? I'd say survival skills, um, not so much. I think the biggest lesson I learned from Tony out there in the in the wild is uh, that yeah, negative energy is not helpful. We can that is that's not gonna that's not gonna <laughs> um, help you survive. Yeah, and I feel like for like my character, I really had to overcome what was uh, like not necessary in terms of survival. Like you know, when you're literally surviving, you know, there's things that you have to do no matter how hard it might be. Or, you know how disgusting it might be or anything like that it, i feel like that was uh, the one thing i learned was just to overcome what is not necessary okay and obviously if you put in yourselves in your character's positions um they cope they have d- different coping mechanisms with what they've been through would you put yourself in their shoes would you cope in the same way or would you have a, a, a different uh, route to go down I think ask me when I'm 16 and I would be a bit of a Tony. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and you know what, in, in maybe not so much of my flash moments, I might still be a bit of a Tony, but uh, I hope to deal with things um, with a calmer, a calmer attitude than she might. <laughs> um, I feel like for my character, I don't think I would because I noticed like when I'm going through stuff like back then like when I was 16 I was very competitive because I was a lacrosse player and I was very athletic so I felt like I dealt with like you know everything that I went through through sports whereas where she goes through something completely different and changes her mentality to almost like like a socially awkward person but like you won't find out why until my episode but (laughs) okay and if you were stranded on a desert island yourself who was, would be the one person you'd want to take with you? I think I'd take my brother. He, um, I feel like he'd be pretty good out there. He, he's got, he's got, he's got some good uh, survival know-how, and um, I think would uh, be good company for one another. I feel like I would take my dad. He would just tell me what to do, and then before I know, we'll probably be off the island. Like, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, thank you very much for talking to me today. It's been a pleasure. Yeah, cool. Thank it's you. lovely chatting with you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye bye. Bye. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching. Hey, you guys. Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys. Is yeah. that from the Goonies? Nice. Hey, you 